Good morning, everyone. Um, today, I'd like to introduce you to what we call is uh, the trucking board for the sales team. Right? Um, look into this screen. Uh, I have a small sales team with the six sales persons uh, and also one sales manager. Right? That, uh, we can see the progress of the sale year today and uh, by each of them. You know, uh, this one is just for me to pop up in the in the sales department uh, monthly uh, for the people to uh, keep uh, them awake from uh, 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 where they are versus with the target uh, for themselves. It could be in a good uh, design, uh, colorful and uh, interactive. Okay, um, so I will share you how to make this one. A few uh, techniques uh, on the tableau uh, with a few interesting things how to process the picture uh, and put the image uh, on the background. Right. Okay, so I start from the scribe. Right? So you see, I, start, I will be built from the beginning. Right? And, uh, first of all, I, I'd like to share you so how data look like. So we have the cell team on the six people here with the one manager so they have the target and also they have the year to day sales uh, equivalent with the percentage achievement right. um, in order to print uh, this information to the uh, tableau I, I uh, just you know uh, scratch the uh, uh, initial uh, um, image of the uh, of the dashboard right, of the dashboard so here, if let's say if the screen, if the dashboard have the height is around six units, and then the length is around eight units, so I have uh, um, eight point six. Starting from the zero. Right? So if I have the first one here, uh, I have the coordinate is one, the center is one and three. So I have one three here, so I have the coordinate. Uh, I have the sales people on the lower row here, so they will start from the this one at three, and then the height is one point five, and then go on for the next one will be five and one point five, seven and one point five, and the uh, about row for the sale will be uh, the. The uh, x axis will be three, and then the y axis will be the height will be uh, four point five. Right? So how to put this on it? Right? So I will create the what I call the x and y axle with the axis, right? Um, with let's start with the y. Right? I, I I I did this one before because I don't want to wait time here and to write, a, write in the code and just uh, 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 distracting you right? so I hey, if the sales person is the sales manager then I put the Y in 3 right? sales person Y is 3 1, 2, 3 and then the S uh, I, I go with 1 and then the sales, peop, the sales person in the lower will be 1.5 and 4.5 so I say, if the people on the lower row, three people, right? and then uh, I have the Y is 1.5. If the same person in the higher row, so it will be the Y will be 4.5. Yeah? Okay. And then uh, I do for the X. We see if the sales manager actually be uh, one, and then the another one will be three, five, and seven. So it says if the sales manager and then one, and then another one will be three, five, seven, and then the three, five, seven. Okay, and then now I print this uh, into. So first one I print X here, Y here. Okay. And then I have the uh, this 
two axes now start from the hero one so as I mentioned in the Excel scratch I will say this one I fix it the X should be 8 and then Y will be 6 okay right I will print uh, I will print the sale person in here let's put that like the chart first and to bring the sale person in here See, so I have the people exactly like I put in the Excel file, right? Okay, so we see the good one, the first one, the good first one, right? Okay, um, I think I will print the cell target on the size of the part. So I have the same one, I just picture that another one, which is good. And I bring it to the video, here you go. Oh, this one. Okay, this here. Okay. And um, now I will print. I will try to create a donut chart. I will say in here we have we want in the donor charts it appear how many percent they achieve and how many percent it's a day uh, gonna make by the end of the year right so in here I create uh, what we call this uh, year to go in the percentage should be equal one minus year to go percentage so here in the measure name it's I will put in year to go year to go and measure value here yeah. so I have two so I print that into the color as well It should be in machine name in the color. Yep, so I have it too. Right? Let me change the color a little bit. So I want year today is the green, year to go is. Yeah, that look good. I want to print this, this, this corner to the other side. Okay, here we go. So we have it. Um, now I will print the picture into here. I put the, the image into the center. So I, what I do is create another one, and in the second one, I think it's I will. Remove all of this. I change the chart to the shape, and then the same person. So, so I will. The reason to do this one is I want to get the name uh, of the same person associated with their picture. But, all right so now we go into the change uh, we go into uh, the another step to change the name but before we go to this one i, I share with you what i would have done 
because I want the, pe the, the, the image of the people who appear here when they're in the round in the circle like shape in the round shape so before I do that I need to uh, convert I need to uh, shape the picture in the round right? in the circle so I have it here with the one uh, people so I, I, I shared you the one of the very uh, simple uh, technique to put the uh, picture into the round right? so in the uh, in the Microsoft uh, Excel or PowerPoint or Word you can just put it and go into the crop and then you crop into the circle and then you go to fit here and then you see it has a little people in the, in the cycle right and then you just save it yeah and then when you save the picture uh, you save it in then you see document you see the my tableau repository and here you go to the shape and then you create your own uh, folder and you put the picture in here okay so that's a point Okay, and now you need to link uh, these people to their picture. So I go into the cell team, right? So here I connect one and here, yeah. Here, here. So now I have here. Yeah. So I do the next one with the uh, dual two assets, and I think it's synchronized. Yeah. I think the uh, if I change the picture a little smaller. Let's see. Yeah. Um, change the size. It looks small, right? This one is okay, but this one is small. You change the picture, so at least this one is 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 still okay, but this one it's uh, almost we don't see the donut. Right? Um, Okay, so here what I'm gonna do. Here what I'm gonna do. On the second chance, uh, I will create uh, one of these uh, calculated field in call um, image size. And I set this cell target. Uh, let's multiply with zero by eight. Okay. And then I print this one into this sum. So see now it's it's uh, all the picture is just eighty uh, percent of this uh, of the donuts, right? If you don't know, we use the size like the cell target, so this one is 80%. 80% is too small, right? So I, 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 I change this uh, a little bigger. The size is 8.9. So um, I don't need to 
this one, I remove this one, I remove this one, I remove this one. Right? Now, I will put the picture on the background. So it's uh, simply go in here, I go to the background, uh, so tracking, and then you can add the image. You go to the uh, uh, title repository, you put the picture in, and then you see here it actually our x is 8, our y is 6, so it's 5. Here we go, so now we have it. So it's, it's, it's not difficult, right? it is, uh, it's, it's, it's just this uh, creative thing, you know, when you uh, want to make it, uh, you know, more interactive and, and, and more fun, you know, in the dashboard. And then, every month you just uh, update the number, and then you use this, uh, this template, and then it's automatically changing here. But one thing I want to do, uh, one more step, is to put the uh, achievement in here as well. So let's say uh, I put the year today presented in the label as well. So it's up here and here. I think it's uh, I format it to make it presented. Uh, here, here presented. Yeah. And if I go into label, I put it in the one row. This in the main color, make it brown, make it under light. So here you are. Yeah. You have it. Okay. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this section and uh, you learned something. Or if you have anything to share or, or what the way you can do better, please feel free to share and put a comment in my YouTube channel. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, have a safe day.